Hello YouTube, this is Gameboy Keepin one here and I am here to show you a quick tutorial on how to make a simple prank slash trolling application or not application but program for your TI-83, TI-84 Plus Silver Edition graphing calculator. Now, to start off, like all it does is it adds one to whatever the user inputs into the calculator and then displays you mad bro. So what you have to do first is press program, execute is all the programs you have that you can use, edit is where you can edit them, and new is where you create a new program. So let's go there and press enter. Here we need to type the name of the program, so I'm going to name it troll, T-R-O-L-L, -L. and you press enter. After you do that, it will give you a line with the program. So then you press program, it's right here. And then you go over to I slash O, press the right arrow key, and then you go down to number 8. It should say clear home or CLR home. Press enter. And you press enter again for a new program line. Then go to program. And you scroll down to number 5 or while. And you press enter. And then you press 1. So it should look like that. While 1. And then you press enter again for a new program line. Then you go to program, I slash O. It's the first one, it says input. Click on that. Then you go to second, alpha. Then right here, there's a quotation mark sign. So you go quotations, two quotations, not anything between them. And then you press second again, so you're or not second, but you press alpha, so you're out of the alpha lock and you're not typing. And then there's a comma key right here that you want to press. So quotation marks, comma, and then press alpha and A, and then press enter for a new program line. And then you press program, go to I slash O, go down to number three, display, and type in alpha, A lock, or just alpha, so you can get the letters A, and then go to plus one. So what you should have should look like this so far. Then you press enter. Program. Go over to I slash O. Scroll down to number three. Display or disp. And then second alpha lock. And type in U M A. Or before you do that, I forgot. A, you have to, whatever you put has to be in quotation marks. So you have to press quotation marks, U, M, A, D, B, R, O. There's a question mark right down here. So question mark, and then another quotation marks. So it should all look like this so far. And we're pretty much about it. Then all you have to do is press enter for the last time. Program, scroll down to number seven on CTL and press end. So your total program should look like this. So then what do you do is you press second and quit because you don't have to save it or anything. It's already saved once you type it into the calculator. So then if you, when you want to run it, you go to program, execute. If you have a lot of programs like me, you'll have to scroll down and find it. But if you don't, it's the only program there. You just press, you go down to it and you press enter, press enter again. And then type in a math problem such as 5 plus 5, like something you know the answer to. So 5 plus 5, that would be 10. And it gives you 11. It says you mad bro. And yeah, that's, that's all it is really. It's a simple program that adds 1 to whatever the user puts in. And so yeah, that's how to make a simple pranking program for your Texas Instruments graphing calculator. If you have any questions, send me a message, leave in the comments below or anything. Um, yes, uh, hope you have fun with this, prank your friends, and goodbye.